Hey, it's Kimberly from Halton Paranormal. Here we are again at one of our favorite locations. Uh, we get an awful lot of activity in this house, as everybody has seen, and we're hoping tonight we'll get a lot more. Um, this house just loves us, especially Kim. So uh, tonight we have uh, me, Kimberly. Kim is here with me investigating. Uh, Christopher is here as the bodyguard tonight. Uh, we also have a few extra people. Um, we have, um, of course, the film group. Uh, so yeah, we're going to get investigating, and hopefully we're going to get some really good activity and really good I evidence. Kick some jackass! Yeah, and Jeff, again, sorry, you're not here. So is there anybody here that would like to communicate with us tonight? You do not need to be afraid of us. We are not here to harm you in any way. You have my permission to touch me or Kim, but you cannot harm us in any way. Is Jack in here tonight? I have a meter in my hand with a green light. Remember the last time you were here? You lit it to red. Can you do that again? We actually have several meters around the room with the green light or candle or torch. If you come close to one of them, they'll light up for us and we'll know you're here. Okay, right, so I'm touch for that big time. Is there a reason why you're here? Is there a reason why you stay here? If you talk why, as loud as you can. Why the time is shaking. I heard that. Did you hear that rattling? Yeah. My, my, my time, my pulse was just shaking. Really? Yeah. yeah, I heard that. There it is again. I think the last time I was here, I was talking about bringing a priest in here and spreading some holy water around. Well, guess what I got tonight? I got sage. Keep lighting him up all the way to red. He's pacing. Keep it a full red. Are you right beside me right now? Yes? Light up the meter and show me that you're here beside me right now. Are you the one that was playing with Christopher's belt? Light the meter up for yes. Are you touching my baton? Come get close to the meter, a little green light. I heard you earlier. I'm still hearing that child. Did you? Yeah. You hear it? His baton is rattling. Again, if that's you rattling that. You just had a spike. No, because it's your bone. Oh. I don't think he likes you. He hates me. If you remember Chris, he's back. I'm not going to hurt you. Can you come and show us that you're here? Oh, 
talk to you. Because Blake, you're red. Are you over by Kim? Wait. Well, another one. Christopher's No, red. Jack's with me. Yeah, Chris is rattling again. That's like a little boy playing with us. I know it's Jack in my stomach. Not very at all. I know you're not. I can hear that from here. And that's strapped in what by three two straps. Look at this, right to the red nice. This trip should not be going off in this way. Like for electronics. Oh. Yeah. You're out crazy. Do you not hear that? I hear it. Can you hear that, Trish? What? The rattling. The rattling. That's his baton. Okay. Leave the baton alone and come touch the green light. Don't tell him that. <laughs> well, I want, I want to be able to see, you know? Can you hear that rattle? I can, I can hear it. Not right now, but I can hear it. Listen. Upstairs still. Jack, come back. Oh, I heard that. Did you hear that? Yeah. Did you hear that, Trisha? Yeah. It sounded like a little boy. Yeah, yeah that's right. Definitely. definitely. Can you make that noise again, please? scared at all sitting here. Maybe you should try and scare me. Make a really loud growl that might scare me. Did you hear that? Yeah, what was that? I don't know. It, it sounded like a hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Was that you that just went hmm? Yeah. Yep. Something moving. You're still not scaring me. 